I'm Luciano Motta, owner and chef of Luciano Restaurant Mall Van Kansas. Subscribe to my channel for more episodes of a simple Italian cooking. Ciao! Hi, I'm Luciano Motta from Luciano Restaurant Mall Van Kansas. For today's recipe, we will make a simple sauce for your pasta. So let's look at the ingredients. Today for this recipe, it will be a bones, can be beef bones, any sides, so normally two, really cheap. Uh, celery, half onion, and a large carrots. Okay, for the fifth step, you get the bone in a large pan and you stick in a, your oven. Make sure your oven is preheated, okay? So I stick inside there, 450 degrees for six, seven minutes, and this should be enough. Let's go. Okay, first thing, so you have all your ingredients, you start chopping it, be careful when you cut it. Make sure they are nice. It's important how you cut it, because what we're gonna do, we're gonna put all these in a food processor. So all this is gonna be in the food processor. So, and we're gonna grind all together. Put it all inside. Okay, after this grinder up, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna put it in the pan, large pan, so enough for you contain all your ingredients. That's good. And we're gonna add olive oil, just enough to cover all the ingredients right there. This is the result of you cook a low heat for 10 minutes about, depend on the vegetable, but normally like that. That's what I'm gonna do. At this point, we go check back on the, on the beef, so on the bones. So let's go see it, they're right here in the oven. So we're gonna open up. That's what the result coming up there. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna get the bone and we stick inside there. Be careful. There you go. And I have water. Into all cook it up. Okay, now after 20 minutes, you see it's really reduced. That's what's the line right here. So now it's ready to take it out. Okay, now I take it off from the stove. We take it off the bone. The colorful is really hot. Okay, we put the bone there and we start cleaning it up. So make sure you have a little spoon. So can clean in all the bones side. That's really good for your sauce. You're gonna stick inside the pan. Just try clean it up more you can. Doesn't matter how, just import this clean. It's supposed to be full apart really easy, so it's gonna be not too much trouble for that. Here. All that, that clean. I put inside here. Everything. And after that, we're gonna put it on the all together and grind it up. And we wanna grind it up really nice and smooth. Grind it up. Perfect, and it's grinded up again. Really nice and creamy. For the next step, I'm gonna pour a little bit of tomato sauce. 
the quantity of tomato salt isn't based on much you want it. So how much density you want it. So that's good. And I'm gonna put it back on the stove. Okay, now I'm gonna put it back in the stove. I'm gonna cook for another 15 minutes around. And I'm gonna put salt pepper on your test and ready to pour on your pasta. Okay, I already have some pasta ready. So after I cook this for 10, 15 minutes, it's ready to go. So I'm gonna be pouring on top there. So a little on top, right there. Okay, you can, you can put as much salt as you want it. Okay, so at this point, I'm gonna add some Parmesan cheese on top for my pasta. Right there, there we go. So at this point, that's the pasta dishes. See you for the next episode. Thank you and ciao, buon appetito.